Hi there, thank you for stopping by to share with Julie today. I hope you're having a fantabulous day. Well, is your iron supplement making you sick? Well, that sure was my case. Because of my issues with fibroids, you know, one of the side effects from um, having fibroids is that when you, when you get your monthly period, sometimes it goes for longer for longer time than normal. And also you tend to bleed a lot heavier. And so doctors would recommend that I take iron supplement. But for some reason, I could never take iron supplement for more than a few days. And usually I'd have to force myself to take it that long because it all would, always would make me feel, you know, really sick to my stomach. And I was like, why was this happening? Why was I, you know, feeling so sick? Because this thing is supposed to help me. And, you know, only for me to realize that I was taking the wrong form of the mineral. Yes, the wrong form of the mineral. And, you know, you're probably wondering, right and wrong form of mineral? Yes, there's a right and wrong form of mineral in the sense of what should go in your body. Mineral expresses itself in two forms on the planet. There is a liquid digestible form form that is found in plants for example and then there's the oxide or rock form of the mineral now when we go to a pharmacy and often when we are prescribed you know some iron supplement it's usually the rock form of the mineral for example you know this ferrous sulfate and ferric sulfate these are our form using a combination of the rock form and sul sul um, sulfuric acid, for example. So that, and then that is put through a process and you know, the, 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 the um, end result is what you get in your tablets or your capsule. And that's what you take. And the body doesn't want it because when we put that in the body, the body doesn't know what to do with it because it's the rock form of the mineral. It's inorganic. Whereas, you know, if you were to eat a, eat a plant, for example, or get your mineral from the plant base, the body knows what to do with it. What the plant does is that the plant, and this is why your plant is the best source of mineral for you, is that the plant sends it root deep into the ground and it converts the oxide form of the mineral into a liquid digestible form into a liquid digestible form that when you eat the plant you can benefit from getting this mineral because the body can assimilate with it but the body can't assimilate with a rock the plant pre-digests it for us the plant pre-digests it for us and so we can benefit from it. And this is why when you take the oxide form of the mineral, we get sick to the stomach, you get constipated, you know, so these are some of the side effects that, you know, you get from, from, from taking this form of mineral. So if you have an iron deficiency, it's better to, eat your dark leafy greens you can get iron from dark leafy greens they are some of the best better sources of iron and use your herbs your herbs that are rich in iron such as you know the burdock root and irish marsh in irish moss or sea moss especially in combination with the bladder rock that can give you a good you know boost you know of iron so use these sources and if you want to buy and buy some form of iron then make sure that what you are getting is a plant-based source of the iron if it's not plant-based think twice about buying it think twice about putting it in your body and giving it to your children and your loved ones i hope you found this useful subscribe to my channel like and share my videos don't forget be the change you'd like to see in this world have a fantabulous day today ta-ta